Welcome back in on our Monday morning here, starting off another work and school week for you here. It's a Monday morning. It's 440 AM and temperatures are very warm. In fact, temperatures right now is take a live look outside. This is our Yark Chevy of Perrysburg camera are somewhere in the mid 60s, and this is very close to our average high temperature for today. And it's uh, well about two hours until the sun comes up, actually about three hours now until the sun comes up. Just the best way to describe today outrageously warm. It's going to feel like the middle or early September outside, maybe even a late July sort of day today. And yes, as Ariel checked earlier on our watch out there, yes, it is the second week of October. Don't uh, correct anything. It's exactly what it is. Satellite and radar keep us in what we call the warm sector. We've got a big area of low pressure spinning across the central plains right now. It's pumping warm air very far to the north for this time of the year. It's also for parts of the central plains creating some very nasty weather. Look at these reports of funnel clouds and tornadoes across Oklahoma and Missouri in the past 24 hours. They are going to be cleaning up from a busy overnight there. For us, that system is approaching. It will give us a cold front to move through overnight tonight into tomorrow. And no, it's not going to have that severe weather with it. It's really wound itself up and it uh, allowed that weather to stay well to our south and west. Look at 11 a.m. temperatures, 76 in Toledo, 76 in Columbus, 73 in Indianapolis, and it is a due southerly wind even all the way into the northern part of Michigan there where you think fall weather, you escape and can feel it up there. No, it still feels like summer in northern Michigan this morning. High temperatures this afternoon all across the Midwest are expected to reach the 80s. Here comes that low pressure system along with it. The cold front swiping through Chicago and St. Louis just after midnight tonight. So it's still going to be a very, very warm evening. And ahead of this front, there will be a couple of scattered showers tomorrow morning, maybe a couple lingering showers. And as this front comes on through during the day for tomorrow, our wind will shift to the west. And even though we're going to take a little bit of a step back in the temperature department tomorrow, still I expect it to be a very mild day. 84 breezy. Look at that southerly wind 10 to 20 miles per hour for today. And as you look at my extended forecast, we're still calling for low 70s tomorrow, Wednesday, mid 70s on Thursday ahead of another front that comes in Friday and finally pushes us back down closer towards normal into the 60s for the upcoming weekend and beyond. Let's get it back over to you, Ariel.